I was inspired to start Celebrate Life SA as a palliative nursing care sister. Um, I was dealing with terminally ill patients with cancer and HIV, and the name became Celebrate Life SA when we decided to raise a million rand for hospice and climb Kilimanjaro all those years ago. And the name since then has just stuck, Celebrate Life SA. Celebrate Life um, SA supports woman empowerment, 100% black woman empowerment in communities where we place um, Ubuntu micro bakeries and wood-fired ovens. We train them up as bakers and they start to run their own business and it's a very sustainable project. Um, we've got more than 200 ovens out there at the moment. I never really thought of myself as a social entrepreneur. Um, in the beginning, it's just a, a pathway that's just happened in my life. I, I think I've always dealt with people as a nurse, then as a palliative nurse, and I've always dealt in communities because I was very involved in clinical trials for 18 years and we were always in the communities with TB. And I think it's just been a journey that I was meant to go on and I'm absolutely loving it. And I'm going to see, it's going to take me to my deathbed, but I'm going to carry on with it. Winning the Social Entrepreneur Award to us as Celebrate Life SA just makes a really big difference with how people look at us. I find all these awards just add to how good you are in the community. And um, it just shows a lot of transparency and Gets, gets the message out there as to what we're doing.